What you in that door, Dolo? So, what I can say from, from, my, from my understanding, I'm going to keep it being with you. When people be just randomly like, God is telling me to tell you where your book at. That's why I want you to tell me where, where your book at. Because you people it, love. You said it right now. <laughs> where your book at? What a book. <laughs> what a book at? I don't have it. I didn't come in. This then what, we, what are we talking about? We done yeah. talking. <laughs> we done talking. Hey, cut the conversation. <laughs> done talking. Uh, whatever yeah. spirit is talking to you, it's not of God. I don't know what we're talking about. Word. God told you to tell me what? Wait, you said God told God told you to tell me I can eat a bacon. Si the Faustine's topping a fluffy egg with crispy bacon. Now he's delicately placing the gouda. That's cheese, Ron. Like a blanket. The toasted English muffin, perfectly positioned. The bacon gouda sandwich, everyone. Come on. Wait. Zinu coffee. Perfection! That means good sandwich. Try the new bacon gouda sandwich. And now try our new small hot or iced coffee for 25 cents. Breakfast just got fantastic. Burger King, where taste is king. Get thee behind me, sir. Yeah, they come and know, like, God told me you could, hey, I know he said, no Burger King, but my God told me to come for number one. It's pretty good. Yum. Hey, what it say? What it say? Therefore, is no great thing if his ministers also be transformed as ministers of righteousness. Look, okay. these demons that come to you like, hey, listen, bro, listen. Go to a church. Listen, I, bro, I, I used to go to Sunday church, bro. I used to go to Sunday church. I know. That's why I can speak from experience. I'm not just pointing fingers like I'm just trying to be rude. I live that lifestyle. That's why I can. That's why I can step on the other side and be like. That was not okay. That was not okay according to Jesus. That was not okay. But my thing is like this. It's like, all right. These false, these false apostles, these false, these false, false prophets, prophets yeah. these deceitful workers, mm -hmm. bro. They decide. They disguise themselves as angels, of, as as ministers of righteousness. They be in church. They don't be on the corner. They be the ones in the church. Really? They don't read to you what thus said the Lord. They be like. God is telling me right now, Lakari, you got a green hat. <laughs> you funny. You like, man, you can see. You can that's that's all it is. God is telling me that. that, brother, your name, your name start with an L. God is he knows. Sir, you talked to my mom before we before we sat down. No, no, no. God told me that your name started <laughs> started with an L. Not your mother. Now guess what, big dog? Oh, yeah, say. She was talking about me. She was talking about my older brother that's downstairs. My name started with an M. My name is Marcus. God is telling me <laughs> that you uh, listen, I don't worry none of that, sir. You lying. You're lying. It'd You're be lying. like that though. I remember I was in the middle of the church. Like I remember <laughs> I went to my homie church, bro. And he brought me to his church. And that's what they did, bro, in front of the whole congregation. They brought me to the front. And he was telling me, like, yo, God is saying he had his hand on me, all type of shit. Like, yo, God is telling me this and this. And I ain't gonna even count uh like. How do you know this? And the congregation was laughing at it, just like, I just know. So like, I mean, was that wrong? Crack that or? book open. Crack that book open. If somebody don't crack the book open, they're lying. Okay, let me get another example, okay? So okay, go ahead. this woman, she came into one of my previous jobs. I used to work the first time. Okay. I used to be a produce clerk. I used to see it every day. One day she just came in and was like, by your head. It was just like, you finna pray. Now, I ain't gonna lie. I believe in, um, if God in the room and, and God is brought up, I stop what I'm doing and I, I see what's to it. I ain't gonna just, okay. now nah, what you talking about? Like, it's God, so but that might be him in disguise. Like, oh, I came through through his, as this person and you told me to go. So I, she prayed for me. I'm like, I'm by my head. And, I, and we prayed. And then I'm like, okay, for sure. I'm like, that was different, but I'm like, okay. Then I wound up seeing her again. Um, I was walking down the street and I'm like, I said, hey, I'm like, aren't you the person that prayed for me in the store? She was like, yeah, I was. And this time she had a Bible. She had a Bible, bro, and she gave it to me. She was like, look, this Bible, it was mine, but now it's yours. And she was like, now look, you're younger than me. It's like a few years back, like probably five years ago. She's like, you're younger than me, and this message just needs to be heard, and it needs to be pushed. And I feel like I'm older right now, you're younger. With this book, you can change a lot of lives, and um, I know uh, that you're a messenger of some type of form, and you could be a, you know, be in the light, be a God, and, and read this, and you could be, you know, push it to the people that need to hear it. So, would you say, because she had the Bible, that that was a good thing? 
if she told me all this, what this, what this is? That my phone. This your phone, for sure. What? Use it. What you mean? I can't unlock it, bro. What you talking about? <laughs> you, you, gotta use, you gotta use it. Call somebody. I can't, bro. I ain't got the password. <laughs> it's not open, is it? It's open, bro. They say Face ID. But, but are you able to open it? Are you able to open it, though? Nah. Is it going to do you any work if you can't open it? Nah. But what's your point? What's your point? I just gave you some, but yeah. is you ever going to open it? No. Nah, if I never opened it in front of you, is that like... Well, she was telling me to read the book. I think that's when it came to me. Like, okay, now it's time for me to crack the book open. Because maybe that's God saying, like, bro... Because you, man, me and you had hella talks, bro, yeah. but I've been sending like a motherfucker. Like, I was yeah. sending to Cohen yeah. crazy, bro. Yeah. Every day, drinking, 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 mm -hmm. smoke, smoke, getting high, mm -hmm. doing this, pop pill. We, we doing all types of yeah. shit. Yeah. You feel me? Um, And you would come through and be like, yo, bro, you know right from wrong, bro? Like, read the book. So I'm thinking, like, maybe that was some type of message. Like, yo, crack the book open. You feel me? So, so I. Change your life. I was like this. Praise Jesus. Because, right? Like, so. It was it was a Bible, nonetheless, right? Praise yeah, Jesus, because you know what I'm saying. So, but I, I'm saying that because if you never crack that book open, or or or, or my my whole thing, my, my my whole thing was this. I ain't read it entirely. With, with, it with that type of thing, it's always important to be careful, and like you said, with the discernment. But yeah. what your question was 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 dealing with the day was today's time, and that's why I'm not surprised, bro. Because Pete, everything that Jesus tells us to do, bro, we live in a time nowadays, and I'm going to just keep it straightforward. Keep it we live in a time nowadays where everything that God says is wrong to do. People say that it's wrong to do. Yeah. And if you don't co-sign people seeing, they will get on dirt with you. For sure. It's like, what? I don't want to... Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Lil Bobby, you, you want to go shoot somebody, and I'm bogus because I don't want to go shoot somebody with you? Be you a sellout, bro. We were the gang. What you mean? I pull up. We pull up together. Listen, if you fall in the lake, I don't want to fall with you, big dog. <laughs> like, I, like, what? I just read to you, bro. Like Paul. Paul said, despises to those that are good. That the the uh uh to those uh, that are good, like or or those that are, are of good or something like that. Like, so, bro. Listen. Like, if that's the case, bro. Listen. We we sh we we can't be surprised, bro. We really can't like just because, bro. That's that's the real nowadays, bro. Like I'm gonna keep it a bit. And actually, let, let me go back to it because I don't wanna. Uh, yeah, it, it was despised of those that are good. Yeah, that's that's what it was. But what could be done in the midst of all that? Because we know the world kind of wicked, right? It's been wicked, bro. But it's it's, been it's wicked. super wicked now. So I'm saying like, what is the future of this, and what what can people do to get out of the wickedness? Because you say we in the end times. How do you escape, you know, things like that, or escape like uh, the evils that are on the on the world? I feel Jesus. like we, I live like we. I feel like we live in. Um, I know we do. We live in spiritual warfare. Spirit, spiritual warfare every day. So we gotta have discernment. And so, how do you feel like um, people should navigate through all this? You know, lean on Jesus, bro. That's the best thing. But look, repent and lean on Jesus, bro. Like, gee, I'm gonna put it to, I'm 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 gonna read I'm gonna read something else because this goes with what you were talking about because you were saying like what's what's the future of this right yeah or how do we you know what I'm saying I know uh, this, this this is in Revelation 12 John is giving it is talking about what happened with Satan how he got kicked out of heaven but Paul says there was a war in heaven Michael and his angels fought against the dragon the dragon is Satan and the dragon fought and his angels and prevailed not so they lost. Neither was their place found any more heaven. So, right, there's three heavens. There's a third heaven, there's space, which is the second heaven, then this earth. Earth is the third heaven, right? That's how we, that's, that's the three heavens, right, according to scripture. There's no, as okay. soon as you pass the clouds right now, you're going to be sitting up there and having like, like, no. There's a heaven where Jesus and the angel, and, and God the Father and Jesus and all the angels are. It's space, which it makes sense as space, right? Space is the third space heaven. Space between the real, the, the, the real the, deal heaven. Yeah, right. and us. So that whole space, that's the second heaven. Earth is the third heaven. You met your question. What, what? Now, wouldn't that put us in hell? Because in hell, the underground, at the bottom, right? No, nah, hell, hell is a uh, hell is a lake of fire. Hell, hell is not, like we cannot see. Like uh, we can't. Hell, uh, the church is like if you go down to the center, you gonna fall hell. No, like, like the lake of fire, bro. The lake of fire is like you. I'll put it like this. 
You will see the lake of fire when the end comes. You're going to see the holy city. Like, you will actually see the holy city. You're going to see the lake of fire. Like, both of those is over. Mm. Uh, both, both, both of those is like, I don't want to. I don't want to get. I, Cause, be. Yeah, because that, that, that's a whole other shebang, bro. But, um. But I need it. But keep going. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, and prevail not. Neither was there a place found anymore in heaven. Mm -hmm. And the great dragon was cast out of heaven. Uh, uh, and the great dragon was cast out. That old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceived the whole nation, right? So mm -hmm. he's deceiving the whole nation. He was cast out into the earth, and the angels were cast out with him. And I heard a loud voice in heaven. Now come salvation and strength and the kingdom of God and the power of his, uh, of his Christ. For, uh, for the accuser, which is Satan, of our brethren is cast down, which accused them before our God day and night, right? So Satan is the accuser. In the book of Job, when you go back to the book of Job, Job was accusing, was, was, was trying to accuse, uh, Satan was trying to accuse Job of, uh, of, of different stuff. He's the accuser. Satan is always trying to accuse God's people of doing wrong. Look, he, he not, he don't really care about you. He don't really, Jesus, he don't really care. He don't really care. I bet you he don't really care. Accusing us of us not loving Jesus, right? Now, okay. this is the part I'm getting at, right? Um, uh, it goes down, it, it goes down, it says, uh, and they overcame him by the blood of the lamb, talking about God's people, and they overcame him by the blood of the lamb and by the word of their testimony, and they loved not their lives unto, uh, unto the death, right? This is talking about God's people. Um, it's, and then this is what the angel said. He said, uh, the angel's like, therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them, right? But this is the key part I want you to remember. The angel says, "Woe to the inhabitants on the earth and uh, and of the sea, for so the angels like, but yo, y'all down there that's on earth, y'all be careful, bro." He says, "For the devil is come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth he hath not but a short time, bro." Same got kicked. It's a big deal when the angel is like, "Yay, who we don't got to deal with that man no more." But hey, uh Y'all do. Y'all gotta be listen, if he calls <laughs> a, if we call if yeah. he tries to cause an uproar up here, that's what we doing down here. And we sin with the big dog and he tries to cause it up here, yeah. bro, be on y'all P's and Q's. Be on y'all P's and Q's. Cause he down there with y'all now. And he's upset. Cause guess what? He trying to get back up there. He he trying to have that like, hey, I'm, I'm chilling, I'm gonna get back up there, bro. I'm I'm gonna chill back up. That's that's gonna be my home. He the only person that's he the only one delusional like G, G Big Dog. Yeah. You getting thrown in the lake. You know what your fate is. You delusional. You think you're not gonna really get thrown to the lake. So, you don't get thrown to the lake though. So what you saying? He trying to get. He's in trouble and he's mad. So he trying to bring everybody. He's in like, him. listen. But, but, if I got in trouble, you come in with me. Yeah. You come in with me. You come in with me. Guess what? I'm not finna go down. Well, how they say? I'm not finna go down this right. ball by myself. I ain't going out without a fight. I ain't going out without a fight. You know I'm, I'm bringing everybody with me, bro. I'm bringing everybody. And listen. And so that explains what's going on right now. The world loves evil, bro. Mm -hmm. So when people be like, man, you weird for trying to... Wait, let, let's go to another one. Because th this is... this. said it. Right is wrong. Wrong is right. Bro. Right sound crazy. Uh, wrong sound like it's the thing to do. Look, Jesus warned us, though, mm -hmm. right? Jesus warned us. Jesus said... Uh, Jesus told us, uh, Jesus told us when he came down and Jesus said, uh, enter ye uh, in the straight gate. So Jesus like, enter you into the straight gate for wide, for wide is the gate and broad is the way that leadeth to destruction. So there's two paths in life, right? Spiritually, there's this. Hey, what's up, man? It's your boy. And you're not watching Dolomain TV. Like, comment, and subscribe. Get it.